If you like music, food, fun, then we have the perfect event for you tomorrow, Mary. And if you don't, who are you? <laughs> you have to like those things. You also may be able to experience something new tomorrow. AfroFast Omaha returns to Stinson Park. And that's where we find 3 News Now reporter mm -hmm. Alyssa Curtis. She joins us live with a preview of what's happening tomorrow. Alyssa. That's right, Mark and Mary. If you don't like food, music, fun, I really don't know who you are. But right now at Stinson Park, they're actually doing a sound check. I don't know if you can hear that behind me. They're putting up tents. Vendors are starting to set up all for AfroFest 2022. It's their fourth annual event. And tomorrow, this will be transformed into a hub of all things Africa. Like we said, food, music, dance, everything that we all enjoy. I spoke with organizers about what today's preps will look like tomorrow. Amazing vibes. Good vibes. Amazing vibes. A piece of Africa right here at Simpson Park is what you can expect from AfroFest Omaha 2022. Cutting a swath across the African continent in terms of representation here. What I'm expecting tomorrow from the crowd, energy, what they're expecting from me, madness, craziness, enjoyment. Afro Omaha's goal is to connect Africans in Omaha and foster creativity but they also want to educate others about their culture. Our goal was really just to bring people together to celebrate our cultural heritage, but also to share it, right? Which is why we're doing it here in this amazing city um, of Omaha that we now call home. There's so many misconceptions about the continent, not the country. You know? <laughs> this year's theme is Women of Change. They've tapped Lagos-born musician Tenny to headline, as well as women vendors to showcase that. I feel like the world was built on women. You know, but Mali said it, no woman, no cry. And I want to see more women in this space. I want to encourage more women. We can do it. Like, the world needs women. The, the world cannot work without women. An honor to be part of it, to be a woman, to be out there doing my thing as a woman. And, you know, the message out there to any woman that's out there, you know, doubting herself, please pick yourself up, dust you up, keep going. Everyone involved hopes attendees, African or not, walk away with a piece of Africa. Bring your dancing shoes. <laughs> Bring your dancing shoes. That's all we can say.